Hello YouTubers, how are you doing? I am still in May with my recordings and uh, our cool start of the spring and then sudden heat wave has caused the nice blossoming spring to turn into an avalanche of pollen. So that's slightly annoying. I know Lone Wolfer had some nice things to say about pollen in one of his videos. Not sure if I can find it. The pollen is not the main concern. Uh, my bike has been having uh, trouble starting occasionally. Walk in the park. across the four-lane road. Taking the occasional rest up to catch my breath. This is harder than I thought. Getting close now, I can already see the destination. And I can say that the worst part is not the inclines or uh, the curbs. But when I get tired, I get sort of uh, subconsciously moving myself closer to the bike. And uh, that means my shin will hit the kickstand. And that's painful. Whew. Almost there. It only took me 45 minutes to cover 3 kilometers. Or actually even less than 3 kilometers. As you know, I already have a new start button. Uh, the start relay was uh, swapped out two or three years ago. Um, so I'm not really sure what is the issue. The relay clicks, but the starter motor doesn't uh, make any sound at all. So obviously the initial thought is that uh, it's got to be the starter itself. And um, um, I and uh, the workshop that does some work on my bike and where I store it over winter um, came to the conclusion that uh, the starter brushes might be worn. So I ordered uh, the new brushes already and um, uh, took the starter off the bike to save some money and cost. That was a good uh, night's work. Uh, and the starter is fine, the brushes are fine, every time you power the starter it just runs, so it's strange because if the relay clicks you would think that the uh, power goes onto the starter, but if the starter gets the power then it will run. Right now the bike starts almost every time but uh, there are some times when it still just clicks and you press the button a few times and then it suddenly starts so I just to be sure I've ordered also a new relay it's not an expensive part uh, but um, it really puzzles me uh, because 
to start to shoot get the power <laughs> if the relay clicks so could the relay click there are some relays that have two halves to it uh, so if one of the halves don't move along then you know it uh, it won't uh, power the starter but uh, to my understanding that's like a, well not exactly a relay but the solenoid basically the same thing I think but um, it it should just uh, have one part that moves and if that clicks then why isn't it uh, giving power to the starter it is a puzzle it is a puzzle I got new tires on my bike I'm not sure if I already mentioned this in a previous video or not we don't have to slow down because of the ambulances on the other side. Anyway, uh, right now we're heading towards these thunder clouds and um, going to the like uh, city or town fair uh, of Gela and um, listen to a band that's performing there where my niece is playing. I may be just uh, filling the air a little bit uh, because I don't know how much time I will have to record at the second half of the summer. Um, yeah, I've been hinting uh, to some plans that I have. It's uh, already 90% uh, sure, uh, even 95% I, I could say, that I'm going to a trip uh, to Norway uh, this year. I already have the insurances and the vacation time is agreed. So, yeah, now it's uh, just a matter of uh, going there and hoping that uh, nothing goes wrong in the last minute. The series of the travel, if everything goes well um, with the recording, uh, will air later this year at some point because usually travel videos uh, take a little bit more effort to edit than just normal vlogs and a little bit more planning but I'm sure you will see the first episode before the year is over so this is it for this one thanks for watching and uh, until next time